Hello students, I'm Pushkar, Master Teacher in Chemistry at Vedantu. I'm discussing J Advanced 2020 Chemistry paper. Let's solve a problem from paper 2, question number 18. The problem is numeric and belongs to the chapter Ionic Equilibrium. In this problem, a solution of uh, Zn2 plus is taken. A solution of Zn2 plus is taken and it is saturated with H2S gas. That means we have passed H2S gas into this. Okay, so H2S gas is here and it is saturated with H2S gas. That means we have bubbled H2S gas into it so that the concentration of H2S here will remain 0.1 M. As you can see in this problem, the meaning of this line is saturated with 0.1 M H2. It means we have to saturate this solution with H2S. Also, you can put here acid H plus ion and this H plus ion is going to control the concentration of H2 negative ion. So what we have to do, we have to find out the H plus ion concentration which is required so that Zn2 plus is not precipitated. That means H plus ion here we have to add so that it can see this ionization of H2S can be represented as twice H plus plus S2 negative. So if we increase the concentration of H plus ion, this equilibrium will shift in the backward direction and S2 negative concentration will be decreased. So if S2 negative concentration is very low in presence of H plus ion, then Zn2 plus could not be precipitated. The idea of this problem is to find the H plus ion concentration at which this S2 negative ion concentration will not react with, S2 negative will not react with Zn2 plus to form zinc sulfide. So how to solve this problem? First thing to establish this relationship. For this reaction, H2S in equilibrium with twice of H plus plus S2 negative, we can write the equilibrium constant is K1 into K2. So we can write the expression K1 into K2 is equals to concentration of H plus whole square to S2 negative concentration divided by H2S so should we write the concentration of H plus ion whole square is equals to K1 into K2 into concentration of H2S divided by concentration of S2 negative. Now let us find out the concentration of S2 negative, minimum concentration of H2 negative at which the Zn2 plus will not form a PPT. So for that we have to write the expression of KSP. We know that ZNS associates to form Zn2 plus plus S2 negative and KSP is represented at concentration of Zn2 plus into concentration of S2 minus. So if we don't want a PPT that means the ionic product of these two should be less than KSP and KSP here is given as 1.25 into 10 to the power minus 22. So that is equal to Zn2 plus concentration, which is given as to be 0 point, uh, 0 0.05 and this into S2 negative concentration. So that means S2 negative concentration is equals to 1.25 into 10 to the power minus 22 divided by 5 into 10 to the power minus 22. So before we move ahead, what is this concentration? Now, if S2 negative concentration is this or less than this, the Zn2 plus will not precipitate. Zn2 plus will not make a precipitate of ZnS. So we have to keep the concentration of S2 negative this or less than this. And to make the concentration of this S2 negative this or less than this, we need to find the H plus N concentration, which is going to control it. So we'll put the concentration of S2 negative in this expression. So already we know H plus whole square is equals to K1 into K2 into concentration of H2S in the saturated solution divided by S2 negative. Instead of S2 negative, we are going to write 1.25 into 10 to the power minus 22 divided by 5 into 10 to the power minus 2. That gives H plus concentration is equals to under root of Let's substitute the value of K1, K2, which was 10 to the power minus 21 into concentration of H2S was 
10 to the power minus 1 divided by 1.25 into 10 to the power minus 22 multiplied by 5 into 10 to the power minus 2 bit calculator. But fortunately, it's all 10 to the power minus 21 and minus 1 is going to cancel with this one. And uh, this comes out to be 1 upon 25 and the root of this, which is 1 upon 5, which is 2 upon 10, which is 0 0.2. So it turns out to be a very simple calculation. So this is the concentration of H plus ion. If you maintain this concentration of H plus ion, or if you make it more than this, then S2 negative concentration will decrease. And this S2 negative concentration will decrease from this value, 1.25 into 10 to the power minus 22, divided by 5 into 10 to the power minus 22, it will decrease by this value. And when it will decrease by this value, the PPT of ZNS will not form. So very interesting problem, very commonplace problem. I think you will get it, these kind of problems in any standard text or practice tests. Okay, nothing to worry about. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for detailed solutions of chemistry J Advanced 2020 papers. Thanks for watching.